So at this time, uh, Sherman and I are going to uh, hand out the certificates. And the first brother who we're going to give the certificate to um, is the brother who kind of came in, was a little bit quiet at first, but once he got a little bit more comfortable with us, um, he started to open up a bit more, started to share more, not only about his experience as a, as a young father, but his experience as a man, his experience like um, just as a young man in a relationship, trying to strive to do better. So um, I just want to give the first certificate to Brother Rodney. On behalf of uh, CS Buffalo, uh, Eric and, and Jelena, uh, Dr. Reynolds, again, Mrs. Collins, we want to thank you again. Uh, they also provide these, these tablets, so we can give these to some of our graduates today. Okay, so um, the next brother to receive his certificate um, is a brother who always makes his presence known. Yes. He is a man of many phrases, yes. um, some of which are only to be said when in the company of just us in this group. Um, a brother who, who's good for, for a jewel or two, come here baby, uh, it's okay. A brother who's good for a jewel or two of knowledge each session, um, always a pleasure to have into the room. Um, I want to give the certificate to Brother Morris Tom. Yeah. Thank you, sure. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, everybody. I mean, <laughs> this one is very personal because this is like one of the main father figures in my life. Um, so I do a lot of work in the community. Um, and my family always tells me like how proud they am or how proud they are of me for the work that I do. Um, and so it was really a wonderful opportunity to be able to invite um, one of my closest family members and closest people to me in general into this space to be able to learn and grow together, to be able to share experiences. Um, I learned a lot more about him um, as a man and just in general. He's always somebody who I continue to admire, um, continue to set the example um, that you represent my conscience a lot of times, bro. Um, so I just want to present this certificate to my big brother, Brian Webb. You know, he, he's very resilient, I would say. Uh, you know, even, you know, through the difficulties of life, still able to persevere, you know, wants to get, get things done, you know, make up classes, do whatever he has to do. Uh, and so I really admire his ambition. Uh, and also thank you for bringing your, your wife by, so we're gonna call him Ernest. Gentlemen, you know, uh, also the, the, the relationship formed uh, for the group, and so just uh, very, very uh, humble to be a part of this life uh, in, you know, in church, and you know, just kind of walking alongside of him as he's uh, pursuing a relationship with the Lord and, and different things like that. Very positive role model and father figure to people outside of his home, and, and uh, I just. You know, really think a lot of them. Uh, so we want to call up Mr. Clark, Mr. D. Sean Clark. <laughs> hey, uh, thank you. I guess as we wrap up, um, it's really just um, an honor to be able to work with you brothers. Um, I like to really believe, uh, you so funny, man. Um, I like to really believe um, in the philosophy of popular education, where like me and brother Antoine, like we're not experts, so just as like we're supposed to be facilitating and learning, we're learning just as much from the wisdom of the brothers in this room. So I, I just really want to say it's an honor and a privilege to be able to create this space with y'all. I look forward to working with y'all in the future. Um, and yeah, let's just continue to build this network of fathers and strong men in this community. Uh, really quick, as we're closing up, I want to call up uh, Mr. Michael McKnight. If you could just come up really quick, I know you want to. Uh, 
But so Michael, uh, Mike McNag is a graduate of our last program, and uh, he was very excited to to jump in and continue to to go with the group. So him and another gentleman, uh, Terry, they are facilitating the group over at Saint Stone Church, uh, and so they're doing a lot of good work. The participants are learning a lot from them, and so we're very grateful both from Buffalo Prenatal and Saint Louis Buffalo for their commitment to serving dads. Each one, teach one. Each one, teach one. And so, and so also, um, we definitely just want to give a special thank you um, to Buffalo Public Schools. Um, Reynolds is back around. Appreciate you. Yes. Uh, yes. Um, definitely appreciate the support um, and the resources. And we want to definitely thank Mrs. Collins for welcoming us into her home. This is her space where she's at, where she works. So the fact that she allows us to come in here every Wednesday into her home, she, she definitely makes this nice, warm, and cozy for us. Um, she creates a nice atmosphere and still allows us to do our thing. Um, so we really just want to show our appreciation uh, for Mrs. Collins as well. You know, making sure that we're set up in the schools and that we have, you know, certain things that we need. So, you know, we're very grateful for the work that Say Yes is doing with the uh, Thank you. All right, so at this time, uh, yeah, yeah, let's do all the group pictures. Okay. Cool. 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 So yeah, uh, if all the if all the fathers want to join us up front, go ahead. Is that cool?